Hello, this is Tori with Landio. We have a new 1.4 acre home site bordering the Lathrop State Park, which has two lakes in Southern Colorado, just outside the town of Walsenburg. All this blue shaded area right here, this is the Lathrop State Park. It's Colorado's first state park. It consists of almost 1,600 acres. And within the Lathrop State Park, you have two lakes, along with a golf course. And the entire southern boundary of this property borders the Lathrop State Park, so you have about 233 feet of frontage along the Lathrop State Park. Then along the north boundary of the property, you have road frontage along Horfano Road, about 236 feet of frontage. And then just a few hundred feet from the property, about 300 feet away, you have electricity lines and poles already in place. This is Horfano Road that runs along the north boundary, so you've got great drive up access to the property. And then you're just minutes away from the paved State Highway 160 to the south. That'll take you directly into the town of Walsenburg right here, which has a population around 3,200. Then this is Interstate 25. Interstate 25 will take you north into Pueblo, then Colorado Springs, and then on up into Denver. And it'll take you south into Trinidad and then down into New Mexico. Here are some photos of the Lathrop State Park. There's a beautiful view of the Spanish Peaks. Here you can see the Sangre de Cristo mountain range. There's Silver Mountain, Mount Mestis, and Rough Mountain. There's Sheep Mountain. Another view of the Spanish Peaks. This is a trail map of the Lathrop State Park. Activities include fishing, boating, camping, horseback riding, hunting for waterfowl and small game, water skiing, jet skiing, and other types of recreational activities. The elevation is around 6,450 feet. Here you can see the contour map. There's a high point right about the center of the property. This is this is the plat map with the parcel highlighted in green. It's lot 255. There you can see the road frontage along the north boundary. And then the southern boundary right here, again, that's 233 feet that borders the Lathrop State Park. The property is only 3.16 miles from the paved State Highway 160. This is the intersection of State Highway 160 where you then go to the property. There are underground telephone and internet lines already in place. There's Horfano Boulevard that runs along the north boundary. Now, notice this sign here, Covenant Restricted. This is a different subdivision. This is not the subdivision where the property is located in. This does not apply to this property. And here's another view of that intersection. This property does not have an HOA or HOA fees, covenants or restrictions. Here's a view to the northwest of the Sangre de Cristo mountain range. Again, there's a road frontage that runs along the north boundary of the property. And right here, this is Greenhorn Mountain in the San Isabel National Forest. The subdivision the property is in is called Greenhorn Village, hence named after the view of Greenhorn Mountain. Here are some of the mountains pointed out that you can see from the property. There's Greenhorn Mountain in the Bedito Cone. There's the electricity lines and poles, underground telephone and internet lines again, survey marker on the property, lots of fresh wildlife tracks and droppings. Here's an open natural clearing, lots of diverse vegetation, really beautiful and unique rock formations on the property. Another open natural clearing. There are mature trees of varying species and sizes. This is an aerial photo looking east along Horfano Boulevard. You can see that many of the nearby landowners have developed their properties to varying degrees. Here's where that road curves along the north boundary and you can see the rock formations there. These are Google Earth terrain views. This is south of the property looking north. There you can see the road frontage along the north boundary. There's the electricity lines and poles. And we're east of the property looking west. There the southern boundary borders the Lathrop State Park. All the mountains you can see from the property. Now we're north of the property looking south. There are the two lakes at the Lathrop State Park. There are the Spanish Peaks. And now we're west of the property looking east. And then just over here to the east you have Walsenburg. Several of the nearby landowners have developed their properties to varying degrees, which we've identified by these white circles. The minimum dwelling size is only 600 square feet. You can use the property recreationally, seasonally, or live there full time. You can do alternative building styles like a tiny home, a shipping container home, a barn dominium, a mobile home, or a manufactured home. And you're only about 16 minutes to downtown Walsenburg. Again, Walsenburg has a population around 3,200. It's the county seat of Horfano County where the property is located. There's a hospital in Walsenburg with a level four trauma center. There's the Colorado State Veterans Home, specialty medical clinics, building supplies, multiple grocery stores, shops and restaurants in downtown Walsenburg, K-12 public school. There's the golf course at the Lathrop State Park. I'm about 22 minutes to La Vita, Colorado, which has a population around 800. It's a popular tourist destination. About 36 minutes to the Bedito Cone Greenhorn Mountain in the San Isabel National Forest. Highly desirable for hunting, hiking, and recreation. To the south, you're only about 51 minutes to Trinidad, Colorado. Trinidad has a population around 10,000. This is a historic downtown Trinidad. There's also grocery stores, a Walmart supercenter. About 56 minutes to the Trinidad Lake State Park in the 800-acre Trinidad Lake. And then to the north, you're only about 57 minutes to Pueblo, Colorado. Pueblo has a population around 110,000. So pretty much anything you need, you can find in Pueblo. And then just to the west of Pueblo, we have the Lake Pueblo State Park. 
which consists of almost 4,600 surface acres and over 60 miles of shoreline. To the west, you're about an hour and 20 minutes from the Great Sand Dunes National Park, which has the tallest sand dunes in all of North America. You're about an hour and 36 minutes from Colorado Springs. Colorado Springs has a population around half a million. And then just two hours and 45 minutes to Denver, Colorado. Denver and the surrounding metropolitan area have a population over a million. There's also an international airport in Denver as well. It's a unique and rare attribute to be bordering public land, especially when it comes to land that is actually a state park and then has these lakes like the Lathrop State Park does. It's also nice to be so close to town and have great access to the highways and interstate and local cities. So we have this 1.4 acre property priced at only 149 dollars all the property details are listed here on our website. The property taxes are only $50 a year for the entire parcel. There's no HOA or HOA fees. There's no time limit to build. Again, you can use the property recreationally, seasonally, or live there full time. We have all the distances to the nearby points of interest, along with links where you can view more information about those locations. Here we have the GPS coordinates and links where you can open up those GPS coordinates on a Google map. We have over 100 photos of the property and surrounding area. These photos were taken just a few days ago. Then we have this interactive map. And just one thing to point out on the interactive map, the shaded area, this blue shaded area, for some reason this shifts a little bit. It actually borders the entire southern boundary. So if we were to look this up on like a parcel map or something, you'd see that the entire southern boundary borders the Lathrop State Park. If this property fits what you're looking for, please go to our website and click on this buy now button. What that'll do is add a deposit of $499 to your cart, then click checkout. Once you click checkout, this window appears where you can then enter in all your information and continue through the checkout process. Once the checkout process has been completed, this buy now button automatically changes to out of stock. We only have one of each property available. Only one person can place a deposit on a property. We sell our properties on a first come first serve basis. So the first person that places the deposit is the one that then gets to secure and purchase the property. Property. Your $4.99 deposit is then credited towards your purchase and we cover all of the closing costs. There are no other commissions or fees so your total purchase price for this 1.4 acre parcel bordering the Lathrop State Park is only $14.9. If you have any questions our phone number is on the top of every page of our website the number is 713-597-7670 that number also receives text messages. We have a live chat feature here on our website where you can communicate with us in real time if we're not available for whatever reason please send us a message to respond to your next availability. You can you can also fill out this contact form here on our website or send us an email directly. Our email address is hello at landio.com. We sincerely appreciate you taking the time to visit our website and view all of our properties and watch these property videos and then ask that you please share this information. Please share our website and our properties and our videos with all your family, friends, and colleagues. The more people that we reach, the more properties that we can bring to market for you. And we are working diligently to bring you new amazing properties at incredible prices and provide you with comprehensive information about each one of these properties. It would be a sincere honor to add you to the Landio family of happy customers. Thank you and God bless.